Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining the cutting parameter that is cutting speed for a drilling machine. So, let's get started. Now, when I am explaining the cutting speed for a drilling machine, I will just draw the rough diagram of a drill. Now here I have drawn a rough diagram of drill. So here we have a drill and a workpiece. When we are talking about cutting speed in that case, this drill is a rotating tool which is a rotating multi-point cutting tool. It is having multiple cutting edges as we can see here. And now when we talk about cutting speed, it means the basically the linear velocity of the drill. That is, if we can take any single point on the periphery of this drill, then what is the linear velocity of this point when it passes into the workpiece? So that is basically called as the cutting speed. So here the cutting speed would be given as that since I will be denoting the cutting speed by velocity v because it is basically the linear velocity. Now if the diameter of the drill is indicated by capital D, so the distance which is covered in one rotation is pi d and if this drill is rotating with n rpm that is revolutions per minute, so pi d n is the linear speed of this drill that is moving into the linear direction that is the linear speed in terms of meter per minute the moment i divide it by 60 i am going to get the answer in terms of meter per second So capital D is the diameter of this drill in terms of meter and capital N is the speed of the drill in terms of RPM. So we get the cutting speed as basically the linear velocity of a point on the drill that is the amount of by which it is moving into the workpiece and that linear velocity is nothing but it is called as the cutting speed and it is pi dn by 60 at the same time. This cutting speed also depends upon the type of material of the workpiece. That is for hard materials, we have to keep the cutting speed slow and for softer materials, the cutting speed should be fast because for soft materials, the workpiece would be removed by, uh, or we can say the material from the workpiece would be removed really quickly. So we have to have fast speed in case of softer workpieces. At the same time, the cutting speed also depends upon the type of surface finish which we require. That is for smooth surface finish, we have to keep the speed slow and for fast or we can say high speeds, the finish would be rough. So in short, that was an explanation regarding the cutting speed in case of drilling machines. At the end, if you all find my videos helpful, you all can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.